Uh, hey everybody, before we do some Kino, uh, <laughs> I, I get a message from an account called Not Monkey Jones on Twitter. It's a parody account of me. It has about 268 followers on it. Mm -hmm. and, and they say, hey, look at this screenshot. This guy, Quentin Reviews, just sent me a whole bunch of messages thinking I am you. <laughs> <laughs> shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Now, if you don't know, Quentin and I have have had a little bit of a history online. Uh, I said some mean things about him because I don't respect him as a person. And uh, then when my channel got taken down, he posted a tweet celebrating it. And everybody attacked him for it. Personally, I didn't really care. I thought it was fine because I shit on him. Why can't he shit on me? Uh, I thought it was funny. Uh, but... I haven't really thought about him in a, in a month. Uh, I haven't tweeted about him in a month. I really have moved wow. on to bigger and better things. But uh, here's what I guess just today, Quentin messaged to an account that is not me. And I can't read all of this. He has a very dirty mouth that would get me banned from Twitch. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how, how how sure are you that this is real? I know it is because uh, I just tweeted out the message and now uh, he's actually messaging the correct account crying about it. <laughs> nice. What a he, great wow. He says, hey, Mumkey. And, and this is all soaked in sarcasm, by the way. Hey, Mumkey. Mm -hmm. Just wanted to apologize for being mean to you once. And oh for my also, God. And for also being such a... F slur. Now I'm not going to say what this F slur Man, is, folks, thank you. but it's thank you. that it is uh, it's a ban worthy offense, in my opinion. I think it should be. I think it's a disgusting word, and I can't oh, believe man. Quentin Reviews would use that word in what he thought was a private message to me, but was actually to some random child. <laughs> so he should not be surprised that now everybody <laughs> is going to see this. <laughs> I'll strive to be less gay in the future. Don't know why he thinks he needs to do that. Uh, sorry if I was too much of a F slur for you. Okay, he goes on. Really, I had no idea that's how I was until you reached out to me. I never reached out what to Quentin. Fuck? I've never reached out to Quentin. I talked about him on a comedy podcast because he was Whoops. the subject of the day. Mm. So thanks for wow. that. Also, the rape comment, cool beans. I guess he thinks I called him a rapist because I said... Uh, I wouldn't trust him alone with one of my younger female cousins. That's I didn't say he's a rapist. I said he's a creep and I wouldn't I wouldn't want him babysitting. I don't trust him enough to babysit my younger female family members. Erich, is that so much to is that so bad to say? Jeez. No, no. Would you trust any random bearded man alone with perhaps the the youngest most innocent uh, perhaps rapeable children in your family? Uh, no comment. No, no comment. comment. No. He continues oh, again. No. We're not even halfway wait, that, done. That, wait, that means Erich would do that. Uh, he said no comment, said so we we can't rapeable. assume. Well, we have to assume because the obvious answer would be no. <laughs> yes. He says no comment. That means yes. <laughs> oof. Mm. Oof. That's a big oof, Erich. <laughs> he, he continues. Yeah, if I had known that I was such a f slur, and a rapist. Oof. Man, he's really uh. Really accusing himself of horrible he's things. Or no, he's right? calling himself one. What is his? <laughs> what is his game? Oh, well, <laughs> uh, I never would have disavowed it. Transphobia. Wow, <laughs> what a hero, man! You you sure do God's work. Well, I'm sorry, Quentin, to burst your bubble, but uh, we have an edgy atheist here. That's see, if you would have messaged the correct Twitter account, you would have seen my my Twitter name is Vincent hates God. I would not be doing God's worth, but clearly you you didn't get that because you messaged a random account called Not Monkey Jones with 250 followers, you fucking idiot. <laughs> he continues. All that aside, this petty drama you started is all a fun little game to you. Correct. Very fun so far. But let's see if it's if it stops being fun. <laughs> but on <laughs> my side of the fence, your fans have doxed me oh you guys want to hear how my fans doxed quentin reviews 
Oh sure. man, this is going to be real serious trouble. He, I bet they swatted him. I bet they <laughs> did the most heinous acts to him. Oh man. Wait, first of all, I love when I get blamed for things that people I've never heard of before do something. That's really cute, Quentin. Uh, if, if we have blamed you for everything that your fans did, you would probably be uh, hung up on the, on the uh, crucifix. But uh, here's, here's the way Quentin Reviews got doxxed. Uh, I don't know if you guys know the definition of doxing, but let's see if this matches up in your brain. Quentin Reviews posted a horrible video about PewDiePie versus T-Series, where he said, You know what? I like T-Series better. Everybody subscribe to T-Series. And within five hours, he was so embarrassed by the video that he took it down. So what people did, because it's an internet video, once you post something to the internet, it never goes away. People were just re-uploading that video for archival purposes. Not even my fans, people who probably don't even know who I am. So Quentin, being the YouTube hero that he is, he filed copyright strike takedowns of the videos, which would give those channels strikes and have potential of them being taken down. And when you do a copyright <laughs> strike, you have to give your full name and it gives the person you're striking your full name. So Quentin Reviews just handed his full name out to people and now he's blaming me when it somehow my fans did it. Brilliant. Yeah. I think this man is brilliant. I can see why he's adept at reviewing children's cartoons <laughs> on his channel because he's very intelligent. Let's Monkey, continue. We must be missing something. There's no way that some one man could be as idiotic no, as this dude. guy. He must just... be playing seventh dimensional chess. <laughs> oh, no. uh, or 12 dimensional checkers. Uh, in order I, don't, to I don't know. What's your, what's your take, Florian? You don't even know about. Man, that, that is crazy. Just, wow, what, what a stupid thing for him to do. Just the idea alone that, that he made that T-Series video and he, he didn't expect backlash is, is just hilarious. Wow. All right, let's, but, let's, let's finish this. And now, now that he knows what my real account is, he's been blowing it up. So I guess I'll read all of those out loud too. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, your fans have doxxed me and have been sending me very interesting death threats. Now, mm, I know nothing about this, ones. but I, I think it's a, a curious term, interesting death threats. What the fuck does that mean? Well, uh, he just gets boring death threats all the other time. Yeah, uh, uh, these must be very creative and engaging <laughs> death threats. Sweet. And I would like to hear more about these, Quentin, I guess while you're blowing up my inbox telling me to stop reading this. Uh, I've been spending the last few months of my life living in fear of a culture you created and nurtured? What the fuck did I do? I made a joke about him on a podcast, and then I never fucking talked about him, at least for the last month. I don't know. Did I create a culture that nurtured a, a vitriolic hatred towards a, a, a fat guy who reviews stuff in his parents' basement? Well, I don't know. He, he has it coming anyways, considering what he said about you, but whatever. I, uh, I don't... I guess not. And I don't even care. He can say whatever he wants about me. That's the difference, I, I think, between he and I. I don't care. He could he could order his fans to send me death threats, and I wouldn't care. And he's and he thinks, I guess that's what I did. Uh, bring some receipts, buddy. If you can if you can prove I ever asked anybody to send you a death threat, I will send you every penny in my bank account. I promise you that. Uh, living in fear of a culture you created and nurtured, so sorry if I don't find any of this amusing. Signed, fucking F-slur. Oof, he keeps using that F-slur. Problematic term, in my opinion. Yeah, we really need this death destroyer, uh, the, no, this, this threat destroyer to come back. <laughs> he, he, we really got a big threat on our hands here with this, this Quinton guy. Sounds pretty dangerous. Was so using the absolute part of his plan. Okay, you guys want to hear what he sent me as I was reading this out loud on the show? <laughs> now we're all oh, seeing wow, this. Already. We're all Jesus. seeing this for the first time. Instant, instant fucking. Yeah. Instant family. <laughs> you just, <laughs> Quentin, if you want me to stop reading things that you uh, DM to random Twitter accounts, <laughs> just, stop. just stop doing it. <laughs> <laughs> you're, you're literally creating drama for yourself, and I'm just telling people what you said to me. You're in total control of the situation, Quentin. <laughs> yeah, just fucking stop. <laughs> Don't kill the messenger. I'm just reading the crazy shit you're saying. He says, why? And 
Every single word is its own message here. So you can tell he's really upset. <laughs> Why in the world would you leak out private information about me being doxxed? He is, of course, saying this in a reference of me uh, <laughs> tweeting out those messages. Quentin, here's the thing. When you send private messages to a random kid who is not me, I'm not responsible for who sees those messages. I had multiple people send them to me a, a, about 20 minutes ago. So Quentin, if you want- How dare you? How Leave dare, out. how dare, how dare I tweet out messages that a random account sent me that he accidentally sent to them. Quentin, if you, if you want things to be between us, maybe start off by knowing who you're talking to in the first place, mm -hmm. you fucking moron. Uh, and, uh, okay, let's continue. What in the world led you to think that isn't the actions of a crazy person? Ooh. <laughs> now, guys, you guys, you guys are, uh, you guys run biased in this, right? You're not on anybody's side. Who, no, 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 no. <laughs> who in this situation seems like the crazy person so far? Me or him? Uh, definitely not the person who's just sitting here reading responses given to him by somebody else. <laughs> You think that the guy who messaged a 250 follower parody Twitter account calling himself the F slur four times, you think that might be the crazy person in this scenario? Uh, that, that person sounds like a stable genius to me. <laughs> okay, now he's uh, now he's actually typing out full paragraphs. You know what? Oh, I'm Wait, just. He's still going while. Yeah, he's while still fucking going. going. Man, this is crazy. Oh uh, yeah. He, he is literally insane. Wow. <laughs> I mean, who, who would just insult someone and then complain that the insults are posted on the internet? It's just, how, how does that make sense? I don't know. I mean, that's just... You know what? I'm just stressed because I've been under a lot of heat lately. Um, what, did you did you lose your your job? Did did they delete your, your 300,000 subscriber uh, uh, YouTube channel, Quentin? That must be some real hardcore stress you've been going through. Oh, did, did your best friend beat the shit out of his girlfriend and get arrested and then they both blamed you for it. Man, I can't imagine the stress Quentin Reviews goes through getting mean comments on his YouTube videos. Fuck! God, I, I would not want to trade lives with him! No! All right. Oh, God. Well, at least, Damn! At least stress. you don't have to live with that face, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he can grow a beard on his neck and I can't, so... You know what? Yeah, but, I'm jealous. That's not a beard, that's an abomination. Come on. Quit, man, I, I'm sorry beard. that you have a successful YouTube channel and you're probably making big money living your dream and that you have to put up with being a celebrity on the internet. I know it sucks getting mean comments and mean messages and death threats. And I know it sucks that you told everybody your full name and now they know it. I don't, man, it just, it, it really fucking sucks, dude. I, I have so much empathy for you right now. Empathy and sympathy, they're seeping out of me. And he's typing again. Okay, let's continue. Before before <laughs> I've, the I've messages never met get too long. Someone as full-hearted and passionate as Monkey Jones is, uh, helping Quentin out in his moment of darkness here. Really, just empathizing. Man, I'm I'm he's... surprised that you're not taking the the Lipcock side here and, and standing up for Quentin Erich. <laughs> By all accounts, what? Wait, what? <laughs> the pedophile. All right, let me finish. Oh, let wow. me finish. Let me finish reading what Quinn is is writing even to this minute. You clearly haven't had negative intentions through all of this, and you've just been playing off of this. Okay, so am I am I a mastermind, a puppet master, ordering people to send you death threats, or do I have no negative intentions? Please clear up your mind here. On that note, I will never forgive you for what you said about my <laughs> family. Wow. He's going to have to give me a refresher course. I don't remember saying anything about his family. I only know ab about him. I don't even know if he has a family. Let's just continue. out of curiosity, what do you think the chances that this this not Mumkey Jones account insulted him first? <laughs> uh, I have no idea. I don't really he, he think it have, matters. How dumb do you have to be to think it's real? I mean, it even says in the name, not Mumkey Jones. So. Oh, man. <laughs> All right. I additionally don't understand how you can't think that your own fans threatening to kill me isn't a problem. 
again, Quentin, I, I guess uh, uh, if you want to claim responsibility for the actions of all 350,000 of your subscribers, go ahead. You're clearly an insane person. <laughs> But I'll stand by forever, and I've said this for the last three years, I'll stand by my actions and my words, and anybody who is not me, I am not responsible for. Personal responsibility. I know you liberals don't believe in it, but it's a real thing. You should check it out sometime. And then he, two minutes ago, he said, man, this guy is really pissed you leaked him DMs. I have no idea what the fuck he's talking about there. But, uh, yeah, there you go. That's the, the, we're all caught up on the quitting drama. Fascinating. I guess, what, what I guess I, what does last one mean? I think I have, uh, I, have, I have no idea what the last one means, but I guess I now have an obligation to say, nobody who is a fan of Monkey Jones should dox or threaten Quentin. So now if it happens, clearly it was not one of my fans because I just used my, uh, tele, uh, telekinetic, uh, brainwash uh, mind powers uh -huh. to tell my fans not to do it. So it should not happen from my fans anymore! So sayeth you? I! I Orders control of all of you listening! Leave Quentin alone! Do not attack Quentin.exe. <laughs> yes. Oh, you don't, you don't oh good, he, know, he has been. He has been. <laughs> Did he finally catch on that you were reading out what he was writing? Well, let's let's read it. Okay, here's the newest Quentin message. Look, I only instigated the situation because I thought the account was you. Yeah, no no shit. Of course you thought that. Of course you thought... You know, let, let, let me do a little uh, uh, look-see here. Mm. Oh, okay. Quentin reviews, and I'm, I'm not trying to compare dicks here. I'm just I'm trying to get into his uh, psychology here. He has currently less Twitter followers than me. So of course, in his mind, when he sees an account with 250 followers, of course he would assume that's the real Monkey Jones. Because of why would Monkey Jones have more followers than the great Quentin reviews? I have to assume that's why he believed that an account run by some kid called not Monkey Jones with 250 followers, I'm sure he truly believed that was me. Because it had no followers. And who would follow a guy who hypothetically accused another guy of being the F slur? Anyway. You guys you guys know the 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 New Yorker cartoons? No. No? You can make the New Yorker cartoons actually funny by putting in the caption Christ what an asshole for every single one of them. <laughs> um, for every wow. for everything that Quentin says, just put Christ what an asshole. <laughs> All right, Afterwards. we have a whole paragraph to get nice. through. Look, All I right. only instigated the situation because I thought the account was you still bothering me. Well, if the account was bothering you, uh, get fucked. It's not my fault, not my problem. Sounds like you got trolled and you fell, you fell for it hook, line, and sinker. And you made yourself look like an idiot in front of now, I think, tens of thousands of people today. So I guess good yeah. job for exploding on an account with 200 followers. Uh, I've otherwise forgotten about the whole thing, and I'm sorry I brought it up. You should be. Uh, but wha what you did was totally in the wrong both then and now. Again, as you just admitted, I didn't do anything now. <laughs> I have not talked about you publicly in a month until you DM'd a random account trying to explode on me and you missed. I would be totally willing to reach out and talk to you about this. I'm gonna be honest. Oh man, it needs to happen. I really, oh, man, really, minds. other than Quentin sending autistic messages, I don't give a fuck about you. If you never appeared in my inbox or Twitter feed again, I would be happy. Every time you tweet something stupid, so many people send it to me, and I ignore it because I really, really don't care. I don't care about you. I've never watched your videos in full. I don't care about you, Quentin. I don't. People want me to, and I let them all down because you are such a lol cow that they they want their their favorite YouTuber, Monkey Jones, to jump on the bandwagon. But I no longer care. You've done enough. You have enough people shitting on you. I don't need... I'll find my own fucking targets, dude. I don't need you. I don't need you for views. I would be uh, totally willing to reach out and talk to you, but I stand by everything I said there. I, I don't care. You can stand by it. You were an idiot for calling me a F-slur. Again, he keeps saying this F-slur. <laughs> Disgusting. 
<laughs> and you should be more aware of the horrible ways your fan base has reacted. Yeah, sorry, buddy. You can go fuck yourself. I'm not responsible for what my fans do. You're assuming that they're my fans because they're shitting on you. But guess what? Everybody shits on you because you're a dumb fuck. You are a dumb fuck who posts stupid shit all the time. You keep you, you message random accounts trying to pick fights with them, not knowing who you're talking to. Everybody is shitting on you equally. It's not just people who are fans of me. I'm guessing 99% of the shit you get is from people who don't even know who I am. That's how big of a lol cow you are. You can't blame all the hatred that you are receiving on me. You don't get to do that, Endless Jets. You don't get to do that, Digi Bro. People hate you for perfectly valid reasons because you are fucking embarrassing and it's not me. I'm not a mastermind brainwasher who can make tens of thousands of people do do my bidding! You are fucking crazy! And fuck off! Just stop! I don't mention you unless you mention me, so if you just drop it, I won't be tweeting about you ever again! So stop! Just block me, man! Just fucking block me! That's it! I'm done! Well, that's, that's too bad. I, I really had hoped that you would be milking this low cow a little longer. Oh, well. Guess it I let to everybody end. down, Florian. I guess it's the humane thing to do to, <laughs> to let him roam free and feed on the grass. He has of plenty course. of other farmers who are valiantly taking care of him <laughs> on Encyclopedia Dramatica and all those other oh, websites. Man. I've never contributed to any of them. I don't care!